In this video, I want to compare the Shun Premier utility knife to the Miyabi Birchwood utility knife. Both of these knives are the highest end knife the companies make, so it's only reasonable to compare the two. But I will say that off the bat, the Birchwood is leagues and leagues beyond the Premier in terms of pretty much every category that you would want to pay attention to. One of the biggest reasons is that this is a fully handmade knife from start to scratch, while this is almost like an automated handmade knife. So the fit and finish and just the attention to detail on the Birchwood is insane. Every single corner and edge has been rounded out, even down here. So there are no sharp edges or sharp corners anywhere but the blade. And the actual places where the handle meets the blade and where the handle meets the end of the knife are perfectly formed to the point of being completely and totally flush. Finally, the logo on the back is actually carved in versus stamped, which makes a big difference as well. By contrast, each of these angles is just a 90 degree angle, so you feel an edge when you're moving your hand on it. When you actually touch where the blade meets the handle and where the blade and the handle meet the actual end of the knife, you can feel a large lip because it is not perfectly flushed. And the logo has been stamped into the back of the knife instead of being carved so you can see where all the metal has been moved out of the way and it looks just a little bit sloppy. The actual cutting edges and the material the cutting edges are made out of are very different. The Shun uses VG Max Steel, which is very hard, it's about 61 hardness. But the Miyabi uses SG2, it's a powdered steel and it's 63 hardness. And the end result is that this knife is probably never going to need to be sharpened. On top of that is the actual cutting edge. The Shun is a very respectable 16 degrees, but the Miyabi has been hand sharpened using their three-step method to an insane nine degree angle, we're talking single digits. And as you can imagine, when you're using an angle on this knife that is roughly 50% thinner than on the Shun, it is exponentially sharper as well. Both knives have a little bit of pizzazz added to the blade. The Shun has 34 layers of stainless steel that you can see hopefully on the bottom of the blade, as well as a hammered finish on the top. While the Birchwood has an insane 50 layers of stainless steel, giving it this beautiful flowery Damascus pattern. And it just really stands out. Full tangs on both knives, obviously. The Shun is a brown pack of wood handle, which is a compressed resin filled wood. And the Miyabi is birch wood, which is one of the woods that were originally used in Fabergé eggs. And it's very, very rare, very expensive. And it just has a beautiful, almost holographic grain pattern to it. It's really hard to describe unless you're looking at it in person. And you don't realize how much attention and detail has gone into these knives until you pay attention to this pin right there. At first glance, it looks like it's just a single pin, but it's actually mosaic. And that means that it has roughly 15 to 20 little tiny pieces of bronze, copper, and stainless steel that have all been placed in this little pattern and then pushed into the handle. So you can tell that someone has put their heart and soul into this knife. Either way, I'll put a link down to both below. If you guys have any questions, any comments, or any concerns, let me know. And otherwise, I will talk to you very, very soon.